What's going on in there, my DP peeps? Josh here with Deprived Productions one more again. 11th material tutorial with the Unreal Engine 4, and it's going to be an easy one, something real simple. I kind of like to keep pushing the fact that you guys can make awesome materials. If you don't have textures or pictures or high-res stuff like that, you can still kind of create your own kind of cartoony, kind of cool-looking stuff if you just think about it. So I got this little black cube here, right? I'm talking about these black cube. Don't be scared. Name, create a material. Name it test. You know what I'm talking about? If you can spell it right, but you got to spell you got to be able to spell, man. You can't be scared. You gotta spell. Let's, let's jump in here and, and double click. And I'm going to show you some cool stuff we can do to this cube without any materials. And I know we do that a lot, but this is going to be a little unique. Some, some math and simple outlining based stuff. Double click and it'll pop up on my second window because that's how I do. Right click. Texture coordinate. Texture coordinate. We've, we've, we've toyed with this some. Now there is something else I want you to do after you drop down this window here. You know what I'm talking about so we can see it. Change the uh, click on this big box here, your material, and make sure it's set to unlit. Unlit, so we're only going to mess with the emissive collar parameter today. So check it out. Here's what we're going to do: we're gonna drag a line like we have before in the past, and type in mask. Okay. Now, just real quick, if because we I know we've went over it a couple times, but you know, if I have red and green checked, it's both there. But if I've only green checked, you'll see black and white, right? Up, down, kind of a vertical. And if I do the other one, it'll be kind of a horizontal. Yeah. Well, let's do up and down right now. So I have the green checked. It's going up and down. White on the bottom, black on the top. Don't be scared. Drag a line, type in power, because we got all kind of power. Powerful people. Um, as you can tell, this is kind of cool. Watch this. As I change the number, I change it to five or four, then five, and then eight, and you'll see what's happening, right? As I'm changing it, five thousand. You're like, bro, I don't get it, because there's there's nothing there. It's barely there. But if I type in ceiling, S-E-I-L, and do that and and pull this, pull this, make this window happen. You see a little white line down there? That's what I it's kind of what I want. It's kind of what I want right there. I want you to drag a line, grab all three of these, control C, control V, and paste them. Uh-huh. You know what I'm talking about, a little copy-paste action, a little cheating. I want you to drag this one back, though. And drag a wire from this, type in 1 minus. 1 minus, we're going to take the negative effect of that. The negative effect of the opposite. See what's going on there? And plug that into the power node. Now, if we update these, you know, we got to we gotta update them because Unreal doesn't like to do that sometimes, but we love them. We love them anyway. We're going to add these two together. We got the top line. We got the bottom line. I'm weird, so I'm going to make sure this is in the bottom one. If you cross them, it does not matter, but I am, I am, uh, I get a little, I get a little OCD from time to time, man. You can't be scared, okay? I add them together. I got this little couple white lines, boom, right into the emissive collar, and there we go. We got a little, little system here, and if I go to the cube, you can kind of see what's going on here. Yeah, I can save it and go out, go out to the world here, look at my cube, and it'll have a little Couple lines on it, little lines all around it. You know what I'm saying? There's nothing major. We'll jump back into it here and keep going. Now check this out. Check out what we're gonna do. Now you could, I'm gonna do more off of this texture coordinate. I could just use the same one, but for the purpose of this video and to make things super easy, just for now, I'm gonna select all these. The whole dang thing, control C, control V. Boom! We got it again. Let's drag this back, make some room. So I got a duplicate, a duplicate down here, but you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna go to these two masks. And I'm going to change them from green to red. So I'm going to change that one to red. Uh-huh. I'm going to go down here and make this green one red. Now, you may have to, again, you may have to update some of your stuff to see what's going on here. You know what I mean? Update it. You know what I'm saying? So sometimes I'll just go to the last one here and update it a little bit. And you'll see that the line is over there. Oh, you see that? A little horizontal action. Wait a minute. It's over there. So that means if I do this, I should have lines on the left and the right. Huh? All kind of lines. I got the lines on the top, the lines on the bottom. Add them together. You know what's going to happen. Oh, God. Oh, God, I can't let them, if the wires cross, I'm going to have a, a mini heart attack. And then, you know, no more videos, so I better not. So I'm going to put them right here, bring the ad up here so it's a little, uh, dr uh, drop the drop the window down. Look, we got a little, a little box. Plug this box into the emissive collar. And if you look at my cube now, it's got all kind of lines on it. See how simple that was, guys? I mean, we just, we took, a, we did a little math, a little math or kind of like vector kind of stuff there. And we got a little outlined box, you know what I'm saying? Now, if it was just a plane, if I go back in here and, and do a plane, you see, just dragging them, dragging them around the plane. Now, this is what I want you to do. Click on the material. Make it two-sided, just for me. So we can go inside of our cube later and look inside of it. See on both sides of it. But if you set this to a sphere, as you can tell, it is not the same look you're going for. You know what I'm saying? So this is this is not for everything. This is kind of like, just, just I, I like it on the cube. I think it looks cool. I'm going to do one more thing just for fun. We're going to keep on adding because we like to add stuff together. We're mathematical arithmetic people. Uh, let's drag all that up here. I want you to get one more add right here. Add. Oh, wait, you got to right-click first. Oh, God, what have I done? Add. But we need to add something to it, right? What are we going to add in there? What are we, we going to be scared of? I'll show you how. Radial. Great. Oh, oh got to spell it. Radial. Wait. It's too. Oh, God. Oh, God. What have I done? Here we go. Radial gradient exponential. Now, that's that dot. You know what I'm talking about? The dot. You can't really see what it's doing. But check this out. If I pull this line up here like that, 
and it's it's adding to something here, so it's freaking it out. But if I actually plug this in there, you see what it's doing? Oh, you know what I'm talking about? I'm going to change that a little bit, though. I'm going to hold the number one right here, and I'm going to plug it into radius and set that to 0.3. That made that, that big old ball in the middle ain't too big. I don't want them balls to be too big. Better update. You're going to be scared. A little update in action. I like that. Cool. But actually, I want to drag a line from right here and type in the word sign. Type in the word sign. I don't want you to plug that in there, huh? You can actually go ahead and drag this up here and look at what it's doing. Making a little ring there, huh? I'm going to set it to 0 0.5. What's, what's 0 0.5 going to do? What's that going what's that gonna to do to you? A couple rings there. A little neat. I'm going to plug that into B. And boom, I got this crazy looking... Cra crub I don't I don't know what this is, but I mean it's it's cool looking. I mean boom, you got you got yourself a little black and white map with box all kind of lines on it, and circles and dots. I don't even know what you would do with that, but I think it's neat looking. And what I would do, just because I'm weird, is I'd go ahead and be like, hey, that's a black and white. Black and white, what's that tell you? That means I'm gonna LERP it, son. I'm gonna plug this into the LERP and plug this into the, the emissive collar, and then you're not gonna have anything. Well maybe, but I'm gonna plug I'm gonna grab two collars, hold the number three, grab two collars, plug one into A. Plug one into B, and since they're both black, our stuff's going to disappear. And there it goes. But I'm going to set this one to make like a, a, like a lighter blue, you know what I'm talking about, and set this one to like a, a pinkish purple pink, and then put them together, and boom, we got this bluish pink purple collared box. You can go inside of it. You know what I'm saying? Go inside the box. Check it out. Look at it. We're inside this box. I mean, whatever. We just made something cool. Real, 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 real simple, guys. You know what I'm saying? I just want to kind of show you that you can actually really toy around with the math and the vectors and the, and the different stuff here and have some fun. I know you got to update your windows sometimes, but yeah, that looks pretty complicated, right? But if you honestly think about what we did there, it was very simple. We did a lot of copy and pasting, right? A lot of copy and paste. We just made one line. That's all we did, make a line. And we were like, well, let's make another line. And then we make we make another line, and then we're going to make another line and make all kind of four lines and put a, put a big old dot in the middle. There we go. Lines and dots, you know what I'm talking about? You ain't never played connect the dots when you were little? You ain't never connect on the dots when you were little? I connected all kind of dots. I still connect them. So, I mean, there you go, guys. A box with some dots and some lines on it, all blue and pink. But, guys, thanks for watching. I love you. Josh here, Deprived Productions. Uh, we are loving it, man. I'm glad you guys like the music we just released. There's all kinds of that coming. Tutorials, prototypes, uh, ethereal, uh, ethereal. Our video game is really getting ready to show off some cool stuff. I can't wait to show you guys some stuff. Uh, all kinds of more tutorials, guys, though. UE4, Blender. Pro Tools, all that stuff. But yeah, man, toy with this. Have some fun. Maybe you can make it more complicated, something cool. You can make it glow and sparkle and, and fade in and out and cool stuff like that. But you never know. You might find something kind of cool for like a cartoony thing and whatever not. But guys, thanks for watching. Love you. Miss you. See you soon. Peace.